It sounds like a bit of a cliche, but the new Audi Q5 SUV is really a good news, bad news story. The good news is it's an appreciable improvement over its predecessor. The bad news, you're gonna to have to wait nearly 12 months in Australia to get your hands on one. That's right, the new Audi Q5 won't be seen here until sometime in the third quarter of 2017. If you're patient enough to wait that long, Audi will be launching with two litre turbo diesel and turbo petrol engines that promise better performance and lower fuel consumption than the current offerings. The high performance three litre V6 diesel won't come until 2018. All Q5s coming to Australia will have dual clutch or torque converter automatic transmissions as standard, along with Quattro all-wheel drive. Underneath the squared off look and barely changed dimensions, there is a new interior that delivers the required level of perceived quality and technology expected of Audi, and a new architecture that lifts driving behaviour and provides top-notch refinement. To drive the Q5 is to understand what overwhelming competence is all about. It does nothing poorly, and it does nothing brilliantly, but it does everything very well. Equipment levels will climb, with a strong emphasis on new driver assist and infotainment tech, and yes, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto will be standard. Audi Australia is also aiming to keep price rises to a minimum, which should mean a starting price around $65,000 before on-road costs. The one thing we can't even hazard a guess about is long-term build quality, as the new Q5 will be manufactured at a greenfield plant in Mexico, switching from its traditional German sourcing. So there's no doubt the new Audi Q5 will be a serious player in the prestige SUV segment when it arrives in Australia late in 2017. The question is, can you wait that long?